Was that you that Phil heard? Never. Loving you. Oh, okay. Is that you, Jack? It's Jack. Oh, shit. Are you all right? Jenny is all right. If you're looking for Jenny, we're all right. Yeah, we're all right. We were just pleasantly surprised to hear your voice. How are you, Jack? It all started with a video game. Oh, God, no! Oh, I'm running! I'm running! I'm springing! I'm springing! During the 2020 pandemic lockdown, I invited my buddy T to join me in Phasmophobia. And it was the lockdown diversion I needed. But as we were easing out of the pandemic, I got a phone call from Phil asking me, How would you like to do this for real? And now... Here we are, just two dads living their best life while investigating the afterlife. Hey everybody, it is part two of our investigation of the Jenny Wade House. As you know, I am T. I'm Phil. And we are bringing you a brand new investigation of the Jenny Wade House with our friend Blind Gamer Steve, AKA Steve the Blind Gamer Sailor, AKA Steve Sailor, Twitch ambassador, advocate for accessibility in gaming, all around great guy, friend of ours from the podcasting years. Bringing Steve to the Jenny Wade House has been an absolute blast. Yeah. and. Uh, <clears throat> as we saw in part one. And this was one of Steve's first time I know, doing I this. Know. It's, like pushing, investigation. it's like pushing him into the deep end. <laughs> and I gotta say, he, he slid he slid right in. Yeah. He was a great compliment to the group. We loved having him. And uh, he just really, I think, uh, was just a further catalyst to the activity that we experienced there. So what you saw in the first part was the top floor of the Jenny Wade House that we should mention. The reason why we're jumping straight to the basement is because we really didn't get a lot of activity on the main floor. The main floor where Jenny was shot, it was it was quiet. It was quiet. It's, been, it's always been and quiet whenever we've gone there. Yeah. Now, we have a theory, and I know we have talked about it mm -hmm. casually. Was it Tina who, who hypothesized the, the, the it thing? It was. It was. We, we were on our way back from Gettysburg. Right. I think the first night that we all went, and we were commenting on how quiet it was on, it, the, on the main floor. floor. Right. And then uh, Tina postulated that. That because of the trauma of what happened on the main floor, for whatever reason, the spirits say this is a no-fly zone. Yeah. And it makes sense when you think about it because we have been back to Jenny Wade four times. Mm -hmm. We've been back four times as a team. That's how active and that's how Jenny Wade always pays off for us. We, we love, genuinely love going to that space. But the main floor has always been yeah. silent for us. And, and I think, too, <clears throat> you know, if we are... Let's just assume that it, it is indeed haunted. There are spirits of former living people it's there. It's so haunted. <laughs> <laughs> I think it validates that at least some of the hauntings there have got to be intelligent if they are avoiding a certain area. And I, 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 I do think that, yeah, it, it, it also makes sense. It makes it, there is a logic to it in that... Um, you know the top floor. You've got you've got the the kids interaction, and the bottom floor. You've got the interaction of of the people who are who are down there. And and yeah, I mean, why would you want to haunt such a traumatic Space. place? You know, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. So uh, we went. Uh, we had a brief visit on the main floor, but then immediately went down to the basement, and yes. that is where this part 
picks up is the basement of the Jenny Wade house. You ready to go? Uh, yeah, I just I do want to just say that don't forget to like and subscribe. Those interactions really help us out here at Old Spirits. And while you're at it, comments are a great way to let us know what you think of our content, what you'd like to see, and even hear about your own experiences with the paranormal. Yep. And here we go. So I'm still trying to work out. I feel like I'm getting something. <clears throat> Um, Are you taking a seven out? Uh, hang on. Hello? Jan? James. Captain James? Captain James? Okay. Alright. Good oh, really? Okay. Um, that's on. This is recording. I am good to go. All right. I am good to go. Cool. All right. Hit the lights. Oh, oh wait. <laughs> Hit the lights. Oh, wait. I got a light. We got we got we got it. All right. All right. Lights out, and we're going to begin sweeping. Okay, that's sweeping too fast. Can you show me some light here? Okay, sweeping. I can hear it going. Uh, that's okay. So whenever you'd like to start asking questions. Okay. I just heard a footstep upstairs, by the way, directly above my head. Okay. I just heard a great storm. Ooh. Oh, my. So who is with us here tonight in the basement? Stay. Okay, we will stay. Uh, oh, is there more than one person here with us? Two. Okay, there are two people here. Is one of them Jack, who we spoke to previously? No, there's three. Okay, is Jenny, Jack, one of you, are, they, are you one of the people that are here with us? Um, James? Yes, I think it was James. James? Or John. Is Jenny's father here with us? Would you prefer we turned out the light? Can you? Couldn't pick it up. Can you turn that light off? Too? Can you? Can you turn the light off? Is that what you would like? <laughs> Careful. Yeah, there was a footstep. Never, never. Mm. There was a footstep just above him before you said that. Yeah, I heard it. <clears throat> it's been wrong time. Another one. Ukraine. <laughs> Do you remember us? Can you tell us your name? Are you coming? Yes, we're here to see you. <clears throat> Are you Jack? <laughs> Did anyone else hear that voice? Yeah. Was that you that Phil heard? Never. Loving you. Oh, okay. Is that you, Jack? It's Jack. Oh, oh shit. Are you all right? Jenny is all right. If you're looking for Jenny, we're all right. Yeah, we're all right. We were just. So pleasantly surprised to hear your voice. How are you, Jack? I'm sliding this, by the way. Okay, I'm going to hear your voice. Oh, shoot. It's okay. We'll figure it out. She'll sign out there. We had a conversation about Wesley, Jack. Have you thought any more about your feelings? Fish. Saying he smells, <clears throat> he stinks. Shh. Okay. Would you like to uh, lead the way? Lead the way. Where would you like us to go? Did somebody?
anybody just sigh? No. I oh. heard it on the side next to me. Yeah. Can you see I'm other two? Oh, shit. Can we see the other two? No. Where are they? Is there one right next to me? Um, you don't. That was my stomach. No, I heard something else before that. <clears throat> I can. What can you do? Do you know the other two people who are here? Something just moved right by us, honey. Also, something sleep. Blocking. Something's blocking the grid. Hmm. Something's blocking the grid. I was wondering why it was so dark over there. Other Jeez. girl. Was that you? That was James. <laughs> There's another girl down here? Is it the K2 or is that the bench? I don't have the K2 out. Oh, the K2's out over there. I thought I heard it. I heard someone walking up. Yeah, there's someone upstairs. At home. Who's at home? What is it? That's me. Do you know the other people that are here? <clears throat> Stick together. We're trying to. Is it an instruction to us or to the other two people? No. Dream. What, what what year is it? Seventy-two. Eighteen seventy-two. Response. You talk so the devices? Got really cold. Yeah. I'm a little bit cold over here. Author. Oh gosh, yes, we have many authors in the room. We do. Are you yourself an author? Smile. <laughs> Always. Well, Jack did write a note to Jenny. 99. 99. <laughs> James, it almost looks like someone's sitting next to you. <laughs> Sorry, what? <laughs> it almost looks like somebody's sitting next to you. <laughs> uh, to your left. It's really cold where I'm sitting. Are you sitting next to James? Yeah, it's much colder next to you. Right here. Yep. Oh, yes. Yes. Sorry if James is getting a little friendly with you. Sorry. I like to make friends. Yeah, it's. I'm sure, you know me. Yeah, you basically put your hand right in where it's very cold. I was going to say it's not shaped like a person or anything, is it? Mm, a little bit. <laughs> Don't tell me. <laughs> <laughs> is one of the orphans down here with James? Do we need to check the grid? I'm trying to around. There's a rat. Oh, James. Are you around, James, nearby? No. <laughs> okay. Help others. You're helping others, or you would like us to help others? Sorry, everyone. You do it. And we're we, right. we need to help others. How can we help? Tell us what we need to do to help. I think when you had been sitting, were you sitting, which side of the column were you sitting by? I think it Hold. Was Yes, it is very cold. She was right here. She was right, right next to me. Okay, right here. Okay, because there's a warm, a warm spot there. I wasn't sure if it was from Dick's <laughs> boot <laughs> Wow, wow I mean, it must be pretty hot. Yeah. So I was just going to watch it. Is there anyone from the Wade family? 
with us. Steve's been under for quite a bit. Yeah. Do you want to? Didn't know if you wanted to give him a break or what. Should we tap him out? Uh, Let's tap him out. He's been under for a little while. Okay. Uh, That's how we forget. Liar. <laughs> I doubt. I, no, I take offense to that. Uh, uh, Steve has been talking to you all quite a quite need a bit. A conduit. I think Steve needs a break. Hmm? Do you need a break? No, no, I'm good. Oh, he's enjoying <laughs> it. <anything. laughs> it's okay. Well, there you go. You don't need to worry about. There's my there's my answer. There's it's my me. Answer. Okay. Oh, me back, who? He's back into it. Is it Eve? Jeff? Eve. 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 Interesting. Do you know any Eves, James? Not to my knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, was there any significance to 1872? Uh, let me think. 1872. Last shot. Last shot. That wouldn't make sense. No. 1872. Crazy. Wait. 1872. Crazy? Isn't that when the dad That's when James died? died. Yes. And That's he just said crazy. And he died at the assignment. He died at the yeah. almshouse. James. It was the early 1870s. Yep. It was actually. You Crescent. What about Crescent? Did you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, I did. What did he say? Crescent. Crescent. But did he say something before that? He said, said you. 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 Crescent. Crescent or Crescent? Like a Crescent moon? What does that mean? Well, I was thinking of your book. Uh, like well, you I wrote a book called talking. Crescent, but I was also thinking Crescent. The place uh, that you guys went to. Yeah, or yeah but I don't think. I mean, Run. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. Yeah. But what's interesting that it said crazy, <laughs> 1872. Um, wow. James, are you, um, captain. Are you, is it a captain? Are you a captain? No. Were you a captain? Are you black? Was that you, James? <laughs> Whoa. That was me, sorry. Are you I, black? No. No? That shouldn't matter. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Good. Wow, James. Okay, we don't have to go there, James. Don't have to go there, James. Now, hold on. This is a different time, James, but um, what are you doing here, James? Are you still here, James? Your nose? My nose. I got to peel it up in the nostrils. Don't you tell on me. <laughs> James, do you James, are you messing with James? <laughs> and James, don't tell on James. You dare. No. Race. Okay. Um, We'd rather talk about something else. Yeah, this is good. You're, you're bad actors. Ooh. We're being uh, nice. Such persistence. We are. Very persistent people. You're quite persistent. Would you like us to take a break from asking questions? Take, take a break. Take a break. Take oh no, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm I, 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 I know, but, you, but you're, you're killing it, buddy. But you're, but uh, that was let's just take a break. It was, yeah. it was interesting. Yes, because yeah. you said what was it, seventy-seven? Was it that what he said? Seventy-two. Seventy-two. Okay. Yeah, that was when uh, Captain James was the last name. It wasn't Wade, was it? Yeah. yeah I thought he had a different last name. James Wade. Wade. James Wade. He died in, I believe, what? 72, 1872. Yeah, because we read it today. Well, and you said crazy. Yeah. I said crazy, yeah. Yeah. I, I also remember, I remember I saying just, shortly after 72, 99. I just heard a voice. I did too. It was like a. <sighs> yeah, I heard it. It wasn't you, Pip? I did not do that. No. Hmm. Did you turn the thing off or no? No, what I didn't. Going? That's the thing. Oh, I would, I would yeah. turn. I'll turn off the spirit box. No, I like the spirit box. It was fun. <laughs> we can do it again with a... <laughs> you were also racist. Yeah, yeah. there was a bit of... It was racist? Yeah. It was? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
There's oh, a little bit of the. Uh, uh, that interesting. That oh, is that when I asked, like, are you What's black? It? Yes. Yes. Oh, oh I was wondering weird. what the hell yeah. that was. Phil, Phil. Yeah, the grid just popped back up. We said oh. no, and then you said That's good. Really? Yes. Oh, well, and they said their family came from Virginia. He was from Virginia. Yeah, and that's why they suspected He was from Virginia, went, thought to be a Confederate spy a or sympathizer. Like, sympathizer like, so it would point. make sense, I mean, but stuff it's happening still kind of shocking. <coughs> yeah. I've never uh, heard anything like that. Was it like, was well, it like anything sure, else happening? Sure or was it just, sure it was just you? Well, just me. <laughs> just you. So is anyone feeling anything at all or no? no? Well, when you were it's cold, you said something about, um, oh my God, what did you say? Something about, really what did you say? Like something like about, you were saying something about being cold. I was being cold. My nostril was cold. You said, right. you, said you feel the drip. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then you said something about, don't, tell don't, me. Tell me. don't you tell on me. Oh, he might have been over that's here. what that was. And then he looked on the thermal and got a cold spot over here by me. Oh, that, that's cool. <laughs> you think you're feeling cool? How, I'm right here. <laughs> Not gonna lie, like I felt like the entire time, like it, it was, it was ramping up, but it was felt like a, a rush of a like, yeah. of just like I'm having fun, <laughs> and, it was, and it didn't feel like it was just me. Like I was like, oh, this is neat. You just I heard it back again. I legit, like I'm serious. Like give me back the spirit box. I kind of want to keep going. <laughs> like it felt like I it kept, like it kept wanting me to like, I, I, like, like having fun. Temperature. Maybe you're a great conduit. Well, I'll tell you it was, something else that's strange. Have, we got according to this. It is 66 degrees over here. I'm According to this, it is 59 degrees. Yeah, it's cold It's over getting here. colder really as you come cold. to the back Close here. Closer and closer to James, and you get colder. Mm -hmm. Sorry, James. Here, do, you <laughs> do you want one of my phase and lights, too? Uh, give me a second. Him, so uh, I have to have a. Yeah. So there were, told on him, there's a lot of talking cold. here. So, so there were moments that I, I could I, hear I, like only like you know, single know. words, but I wasn't too sure like what like what they were. Man, that would kind of freaky if I went here. I don't even know what I would say. <laughs> okay, so now it's picking you up. Because it was, <laughs> there was some that I, it was some moments I could tell, like, oh no, I I, I recognize the song or something like that. And yeah. It wasn't like it, like, I, um, like I could tell that there was nothing really there, but I was like I could still hear the words. So I was like kind of just trying to discern what was being cut, like coming through through the individual channels. Mm. Um, and that's also, what I was. Also, when you were under, we could footsteps upstairs. Did you hear a woman? No, noise? Really? I heard a hum. Yeah. A woman mm -hmm. humming. I thought I heard the doors creaking. All right. We heard humming before. And all I'm hearing is my is my uh, is, is Big G going on. But uh, I mean, legit, I'm feeling right now. You want to keep going? I need that spirit box. Like I'm I'm like like I'm feeling like There's something. To I say. need it. I like mm -hmm. I'm. Like, yeah, like it's like it's I jumping keep, in the bed. I keep hearing thumps and thuds upstairs. Like, All right, well, the, the last thump you probably heard was me because I'm. Um, no, there was, there was a couple upstairs. All right. All right. All right. All right, my friend. Okay. Going back in. Going back in. All right. All right. I'm gonna play a little harmonica. Oh wait, before uh, before you go back in, Steve, there was somebody who had a question for you. How uh -huh. are you handling the How are you handling the dark? Oh, fine. I mean, because I'm not having to move around and I don't need to see where I'm going. I'm fine. There you go. All right. Say goodbye, Steve. Okay. Say goodbye, Steve. <laughs> goodbye, <laughs> Steve. Oh, oh, can I get your light? Thank you. Okay. Let's see if we can talk to Jack again, because last time we were here. Have a little harmonica? Yeah, do a little harmonica for Jack. Yeah. Keep playing. <gasps> oh. Keep playing then, Phil. That's good. Good. Thank you very much. I, I enjoyed playing harmonica. It was weird because before that it was just cycling through just music only. 
Huh. <laughs> oh, wow. That's pretty fascinating. That is very interesting. In the cold. It, I just sat down and it's like freezing it's over like here. It's freezing. It is freezing over here. That and, and that is. Oof. So. Oh, hello. <laughs> when we were last here, we talked to Jack. 60 degrees. And we talked yeah, to Jack. We talked to Jack about Wesley. It's warmer. Would you like to talk about Wesley? Whoa, you're back. We are. We are back. 11.7. On the case, on the case, no. Yeah. You don't want to talk about Wesley. He was your friend. He carried your message. <laughs> what was that? Was that, that was me. That was me. Do you want to talk about Jenny? You remember the twelve point nine. Is that EMF? That was EMF. Is it picking up off your phone? No, on my phone it's point six point seven. Huh. Then fourteen point one. Them back to point six. Do you remember these devices that we have? <clears throat> we enjoyed our conversation last time we were here. Brandy. We did not bring any brandy. I'm sorry about that. No brandy. Oh, I heard something over there. That was me. Okay. What would you like? No to way. <laughs> <laughs> yes, tea makes noises. Tea. Would you like to have a chat with me? Stop. I will. Okay. I will stop. I'm just trying to get set up. We want to talk to you. Is that okay? Yes. Good. Thank you. We enjoyed our conversation last time. What would you like to talk about? Connection. Connection. Go back. Go back? Go back, Phil. Oh, okay. Go back. Go back. Okay. The grid's out again. Last. This is our last stop for the night. Yeah, in fact, we'll be uh, wrapping up not too long from now. Is there anything we can help you with? Embrace. Oh. Embrace. We felt, well, we felt a connection. We felt we did embrace you when we were here last. That discussion we had meant a lot to us. Do you just, hear? Did you just, I did hear. Did you hear a woman voice or like a home? Did anyone else hear that? No, but I'm sure I will okay. later. <clears throat> a little bit. A little bit. Who are we talking to right now? <coughs> Excuse me. Me. <laughs> <laughs> you are funny. And <coughs> I have a feeling it's Jack because remember Jack had that had that Jack witty response through here. Yeah, Jack was a bit of a witty fellow. How are you? Oh, very nice of you to ask. We are doing quite well. That was probably me setting up. No, that's temperature. Oh, You're sorry. at the end. We are at the we end. We are at the night. end. But if there's anything else you'd like to tell us, anything we can do for you, any message that you have? Tea. Hmm. Oh, did you, came back on. Did you want to talk to me about something? David John. David John. David John. Does that mean anything to you? David James? Not necessarily. Did you have a question for me? I don't know a David John. 
But did you have a question for me? Little girl, walk. You're good. Are you talking to someone else in here? One of the orphans, maybe? I heard something click up there. Are you keeping an eye on the little girl? Goodness. Oh. Sure. You get the feeling you were a good guy, Jack. That's a temperature drop. 0.6 on the, uh, point oh one. Why are you down here in this basement, oh, Jack? You're forgiven. Oh. Babe, was, did someone just move by, like, was that? I just heard something behind me move. Yeah, I heard, I heard it. Little baby. There was a little baby down here. In the water. In the water? Oof. What was that? Oh, uh, it was, it was fast, Eddie. How could you? Okay, that's... Are we still talking to Jack? Yes. No. Yeah, I was <laughs> say, who are we talking to? Might be more than one person, Dad. Can you tell us your name? Josh. Josh. Does that name sound familiar, James? No. no. Josh isn't all. Josh? Josh who? Could be a random soldier as well. If if he gives another if he gives another Philip. Philip. Right. I think that's, need, that's my name. Yes. Do we want to pull him out? Just give him another break? I think he's good. Maybe for a little bit. We'll see how the next You're year. funny. We'll see how the next I'm year just year. concerned. That's all. I am not trying to be funny. I think I think I think Jack's giving you some attitude, I <clears throat> Josh, like are you a soldier? Or is his name Philip? He's not talking about you. I his name is Philip. Or is your name Philip? The light on. Light on. I think the grid just got brighter. It did. When he said that. That's interesting. Things moving around upstairs. Yep. That was you. No, that was not No, us. the light, well, the light that just turned on my friend Steve, that was me. I just want to make sure that Steve is okay. Do you want me to turn the light off? Just a little. <laughs> Just a little, yeah, I had another noise. All right. Oh, Jack, I get the impression you want to talk to us. Is that okay? You do want to talk to us? EMF's going up. Servicemen. Servicemen. That's me. That time, that, that, that time, that was your beautiful yeah, good tape. How many of you are there down here with us? How many of you are there? Maybe thirty. Jason. Uh, it's a little, a little small down here for thirty people. Kind of crowded for 30, I think. A bit, uh, a bit crowded. Is Jenny down here with you? No. That's good to know. <laughs> Do you know where Jenny is? Maybe. Working. She was working when she was getting... Little baby. Jeez, yeah, I think it was a little baby. That's crazy. It was a crazy time. Is this, is this Jenny's dad again? He keeps coming back to little baby. Mm -hmm. Crazy. I will. You will? What? I will. What will you do? Crack you. Okay, out, out, yeah. pull him out, pull him out, pull him out, pull him out. What? 
He said, I will crack you. Yeah, he said, okay, mm, yeah, we're going to give you a break. Oh. Sorry, I was <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's intense, isn't it? I just felt shivers. So like, yeah. Yeah, and you mentioned little baby again. And crazy. It was weird. So there was a period in there where I did, like, I felt different. Like, it was, like, thing, there was a bit, it was a bit disjointed, and I couldn't. Like there was like I couldn't get into a flow. That last like minute, two minutes, mm. it was like a, a different sort of feel. No, I, like it was like it was something that was trying to. You didn't make that sound. Push through, like, like I am like when, okay, I'm now in, like basically like you know how when you get into like tunnel vision to like a project and into a zone. Yeah. Yeah. That's how I felt for like the past after, like two three minutes. After that crack, you after the men, you know I will crack you. Um, this is not Matt in my chat just went, seems friendly. And so, you know. <laughs> I don't think that was um, Jack. I don't think that was Jack. And I and honestly, Steve, that that's the thing about the the Estes method is that when you get into it, it sometimes you can go into a trance. It's like you a start to stay. Yeah, yeah I, it, start it was this one this one was different than the first first session. First one, yeah. Because the first session I kind of felt like there was a through put, like there was a constant kind of like flow. Right. This one felt like it would. It started out off fine, and then it would came like disjointed. Like I couldn't connect. Right. And then the last two minutes was kind of like I was, I was whatever. Like it. It, it felt similar to the first session. It's almost as if like whatever was there was like came back. Which is interesting because it seemed like you were talking to Jay's dad in the in the first session. And oh really? And then that's what you said it kind of came back around to. When we got the eight when we got the seventy-two. It was servicemen is when it started to come back. Interesting. This corner has quieted down I, it, it is, I am cold over here. Yeah, um, it's, whoa, it's, uh, according to where I'm sitting, it is 62 degrees, it's 64 over there. It is like, it got, so it got colder as soon as you pulled me out. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Was that you, James? Sorry, what am I going to Okay. Because yeah. <laughs> yeah. right. that was not a good sound if it wasn't you. <laughs> <clears throat> And there's plenty of distance, but there's plenty of distance between my phone and this. Yeah. But the the, the I'm getting all kinds of fluctuations on the. I'm internet. getting like yeah, I'm getting shivered right now. Yeah. Is there still someone down here with us? Oh, I'm gonna go in. Oh no no no. <laughs> Not for you to go back. Oh well, I, I, I mean I could still going. <laughs> now let's, let's see if we can get interactions yeah. any other way. Okay. So let's let we're just gonna give it a break. Uh, if there's still when, when it when it makes a threat, that's when you're like. Eh, is it, that's the thing. It did not feel like it was a threat. Mm. When you pulled me out and you said, no, no, you're, you're done, you're done. I'm like, wait, like, why? Okay. So if there's still someone down here with us, can you let us know by maybe knocking? How about we try what we did upstairs? I'm going to go on ahead and I'm going to give, uh, I'll, even, I'll even make it a little easier on you. A minute. Um, turn on this REM pod. There you go. All right. You can have the. Is that you? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> If that's you, could you back away from the device? Thank you. Um, so I tell you what, if you uh, can finish this pattern, you can either do it with a knock, with another knock, or you can go on ahead and you can um, do what you did upstairs for my friend Phil and make it beat twice. Okay, so I'm going to do a pattern see if you can uh, complete it. Here we go. Did anyone hear a voice? It's right after T knock. I think it was the, the spirit box. My stomach also grumbled. Okay. 
Actually, we're not gonna shoot that. Bad boy off. Try you sure? Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's me making the beeps. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you glad I'm sitting here, or do you want me to move? Because I'm making this other thing really beep, huh? I think that's kind of hot. I know, a lot of stimulation. Give a lot me a of, second. A lot of beeps and boops. Okay, I'm yep, open. Yep, yep. Okay. Could you please uh, back away from it for just a moment? Thank you. Thank you. So you can either make that beep twice, or you can make that device beep twice, the one with the blue lights. I'm going to try this pattern one more time, okay? Wrapping up here very soon. Yeah. How? Yeah. How about I play um, like we did last time? We played a little harmonica before we wrapped up. Would you like that? Sorry, I got like a little weird there because I swear I saw what looked like a little, like, I don't want to say orb, but like a light, like, come toward me. And it freaked me out a little bit because <laughs> it was really bright. Someone who appreciates your music. Though. I think I was so. Gonna say, look, I would say, yeah, whatever was near me is, is, it's not, I don't feel it anymore. It's gone. And the weird thing is, it's actually getting colder on your side. What was that? That was a wind? I think it was a car. Oh, it was a car? Okay. Uh, we want to say thank you for letting us come here tonight and come down here and talk to you. You know, we wish we knew why you felt like you had to stay down here in the basement. Maybe you already let us know and we'll hear it. Would you like us to come back sometime? Feel free to give us any kind of sign because we're listening and we're watching right now. Any kind of sign. Oh, Sorry. I was just going to say, if Jack's here, I want to say thank you. And if the kids are here, or if you're upstairs and you're listening with your ears to the floor, you guys were a lot of fun tonight. And when we leave, remember you have to stay in this space. This is, this is uh, where you're supposed to be staying. You can't come back with us tonight. Or with James, for that matter. But I'm sure you'll see James again sooner than you'll see us, but we will come back and visit you again. Maybe with our friends, our new friend Steve. Maybe with somebody brand spanking new. But thank you for letting your presence be known. I'm sure Steve has a story or two to tell. <laughs> that was my foot. Oh, excuse me. That was me. That was me. <laughs> and on that note... Lights up. Lights up. 
What a finish. Oh, yeah. I mean, it, Jenny Wade always, del I've said, I said it in part one, I said it back in the couples weekend, Gettysburg always delivers. Jenny Wade is this incredible area of consistency, paranormal consistency. It brings if it. You will. Yeah. It brings it. And I mean, hat tip, hat tip to yeah. Steve Saylor for one incredible Estes method. Oh, yeah. For someone who'd our, never done it before. Yeah, no, it's some, never done before. Some of our best. Yeah, Steve was a natural. Yeah. He, I, again, it, it's funny because you've heard me talk about um, how jealous I get of your Estes sessions. Watching his, I was just like, man. Yeah, I was jealous too. <laughs> <laughs> he seems to, he just, as you, you can see by watching the footage, he just slides right into that state and really, really, I think, really taps into something. Almost dangerously addictive, though, the way he was like, I got to get back in. Yeah. I got to get back in. Yeah. I got to get... I was worried we were going to have to, you know, do an intervention or something, but <laughs> but no, no, he was... Um, and, and his responses, his responses were just... Yeah. It, it, was, it was direct. It was interactive. Yeah. Uh, probably one of the more interactive yeah. Essie's methods I think we featured here on Old yeah. Spirits. Yeah. And, you know, also, I just want to point out, so in the footage, you also see uh, the captions come up that say footsteps upstairs. Yep. We heard a, a lot of movement uh, while we were down there, mm -hmm. which is apparently consistent with reported activity at Jenny Wade, or the footsteps on the, in the upstairs. And I'm glad you brought up the titles because there was a title that I said we were going to be talking about in depth. And it was the grid. The grid. The yes. grid. Okay. Yes. Okay. So bad news. This is going to be a debunk. So brace, brace, brace. But yeah, one of the problems that I have had, and uh, this is this is consistent because one of the problems I've had with Big G is that if I don't plug him into a power source, yeah, uh, we get fluctuations that 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 come up with false positives. False positives. But we've learned that over time. Right. But yeah. at the time that we did this particular recording, we did this particular um, uh, this particular investigation, I was still running Big G Sun's battery pack. Yeah. And you're still getting, you're getting to know the device. Yeah. And, and that and takes time. It does. That takes time. It does. I think you mentioned it earlier is that the, the design of the Big G, there might be a problem with the power regulation. Right. And because of that, you plug it into a battery pack, it yeah. is yep. fine. Apart from that, um, Mel came out to play. Simon came yeah, out to hits play. Hits on Simon. Yeah. Hits on Steve. Yeah, hits on Steve. <laughs> <laughs> but also and just a ton of personal experiences as well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hearing voices. Right. Feeling cold spots manifest around us. I mean, it was popping down there. And it, that basement is it's quite an intense spot. And when you think also about how the floor above it, where the deed occurred, mm -hmm. where the deed occurred, we got nothing. Yeah. But then we go down to the basement mm -hmm. where they kept the body for a few days and mm -hmm. people stayed with the body and it's just, it's paranormal Papa Palooza. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, <laughs> you just go with it, I guess. Yeah, you go with it. You know, I, 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 when it comes to the takeaways of Gettysburg, I always go back to season one. Yeah. I yeah. mean, it is, I remember the words, so you weren't there for this, but uh, I went on a ghost tour yeah. with a, another Twitch streamer and, and it was a, a group of us who were all, uh, you know, we're all part of the same community with, uh, with BBXH. And I remember uh, our tour guide, Turns out the tour guide, just quick side note here, the tour guide turned out was a steampunk captain oh, yeah. from the steampunk <laughs> community, and we reunited with him there and then. Yeah. So at that moment, everybody who had just met me that night were like, oh, this dude's connected. <laughs> <laughs> but, I, but, but here's the thing. Um, this guy, his name is Cedric Whitaker. Mm -hmm. um, he hails from New Orleans, mm -hmm. and he said, we got a saying here in Gettysburg. In New Orleans, you can't throw a cat and not hit a ghost. In Gettysburg, it's two. And that was what he, that's how he opened up our ghost tour. I mean, and, and, yeah, and that's, he's right. It, it's a, it, 
for for I, and, and I, I I go back to what is it about Gettysburg? Is it is it because of what happened in those three days? Is it because of the land itself? Because it is very old land. Yeah, and, and you know you know that's a. We have been to enough battlefields now, yeah, and have have spent a good length of time uh, with various pieces of equipment, and I mean there is juju, there is juju on battlefields. Yes, but, 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 but there is a little something extra. There is something when it comes super to extra about Gettysburg. Yeah, yeah. and uh, I maybe it's because it was such a decisive battle, but then again, so was Manassas, mm-hmm. so was Antietam. Yeah, when we we've been yeah. to these other battlefields. Yeah. But Gettysburg on a whole is, and, and, and it's not just us. There are other paranormal investigators. Yeah, including who, popular television. That yes. Has some numerous visits to Gettysburg. And, and they all say the same thing. There's something about this place. There's something yeah. about this place. Yeah. I mean, we, we, have, uh, we have some, uh, some, some friends from Twitch who are like, I'm so jealous of where you guys are because you're only a dr- barely a, a day's drive away from Gettysburg. I'm like, more like in the afternoon. Yeah. You know, I, I mean... mean we get home late after yeah, something like this. Yeah, we can day, but, but we can day trip it. Yeah, don't have to easily. Stay there, so no, you don't. It's, you don't. And there's so many other places we haven't gone to, but it's hard no. to leave Jenny. Yeah, <laughs> it's hard to leave keep, my Jenna. We keep coming back to Jenny. We keep coming back to Jenny. <laughs> and and for, for very good reasons. reasons. <laughs> for very good reasons. Yeah. Boom, baby, right, right there. That's right. Um, so yeah, I think I think the big takeaway I, w- I would say about Jenny Wade and Gettysburg is that consistency. Yeah, and it's. I think that's why. It's one of the reasons why so many um, paranormal investigators like to go to Gettysburg again and, and again. again. It just. It's 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 reliable. Yeah, yeah. So that brings us to the end of this investigation featuring Blind Gamer Steve. Trust me, he will be back. We're <laughs> trying to find a, a, a yeah. bigger, badder, more intense place to take Steve, and then we'll see how the Estes methods go oh, then. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> <laughs> and um, Phil, we have a lot of gear that we feature uh, in these investigations that we do. So where would people want to go and how should they shop <laughs> if they wanted the same gear that we use? In the I'm, I'm glad you asked. I know you I'll are. start off with the how should you shop there you go. compulsively. <laughs> like, like money is no object. <laughs> per- perfect. Where perfect. to shop? You'll notice in the description, there is a ghost stop affiliates link because as we've mentioned many times, we are ghost stop affiliates. And so if you're interested in picking up some of this, really fun gear hit that link we get a little kickback you get some new toys you also support small business and uh, everyone wins so on that note thank you very much we will be seeing you in a couple weeks with a brand new investigation our last investigation for season two Mm -hmm. don't worry there will be a season three and we look forward to bringing all that to you in a few weeks featuring this time the ghoulie girls but until then on behalf of everyone here at old spirits take care stay safe and we'll see you in the field.